Okay, this is going to be Dakota's second time with her single, but it's being tightened, but it's going to be her first time walking forward with it. I think she might have taken like a step or two with it the last time. I don't exactly remember. I'm going to have to go back and look at that, but she's actually going to walk forward a lot more with it. I like to break it down, take my time nice and slow because I, I really don't want any bucking to happen. Don't want any hopping. I don't want any tension. I don't want it to be a big deal at all. I want it to be very positive. I want her to want to wear the surcingle or the saddle or whatever I'm putting on her back and it just be positively reinforced. So like every time it's on her back, she gets lots of reinforcement for it. Um, I don't want it to be a big deal. So there she kind of was a little tight. I'm not sure if that was about the surcingle or not, but she kind of raised her head and she did come back and relax a little bit. So it could have been a, like a bug biting her, a fly biting her, but it could have been the the stir single too. Oh, it could be also me clicking. So I'm not sure exactly when I voice these over, I have to turn the sound off. So it could, could be that as well, but you gotta be careful. I mean, it, as you watch this, you want to pay attention to what's happening there. I think this is actually, she's uncomfortable with it. Cause she looked like she was pinning her ears a little bit there. And then she wants to back away here and not let me kind of go near it. So I got to watch that and pay attention. Yeah. She's got a little bit of an ear pin there. So, and I didn't notice that at the time, um, cause I did girth it very slowly and we started at the bottom and, you know, would put one hole, one hole, one hole, and I didn't girth it up really, really tightly. So you gotta be careful with that. And then, I mean, star singles can be just uncomfortable in general. So you have to be care careful with that. And she's, you know, she's new. So she's never had one on consistently. She's had them on a couple times, but, and she did well with that too before, but today she just, she seems a little bit uncomfortable with it. So, um, and at the time I did not know that, notice that. So very important to notice those little details. So, I mean, I am practicing at this point, like I'll put it on, I'll tighten it, I'll take it off. And I kind of just do that randomly or I might not, it just kind of depends. Um, so that's not me noticing and like taking it off and being like, oh, let's do something else. I didn't notice the ear pin at all until I'm actually watching the footage back. So definitely be on your toes. I know it's, you get focused because you want to make sure the stir single's on. You, you're kind of looking for legs. Um, you're looking for head stuff. But yeah, every single time I go to tighten it, she's raising her head. So, and again, that could be the click. I might be clicking at the same time, but that, not this time, but the last time definitely looked like an ear pin. So. And especially when you're tightening it up, that time looked better. When you're tightening it up for the first few times, you do want it tight enough. So like if something were to happen, the horse were to run, this looks much better. Um, you don't want it to get off and you don't want it to slide back and become a bucking strap. So that could play into it as well as, as like I was, this specific time I was tightening it more or I was tightening it faster than I usually did. So like I was tightening it more quicker than I had before. So that could be definitely a thing. Um, because in the past it would be, you know, it just touches her belly and then I put a little pressure, I put a little bit more pressure, I do one hole, another hole, another hole until it's tight, um, which I should have done here, but, um, but yeah, I think I was, what, what I was doing was, oh, we're going to put the sourcing on, I want her to walk, but I want it to stay on. So, um, be, be careful about that. You want to have a good tightness, but not too tight for their uncomfortable because you want it to be a positive experience. But so then I'm just asking her to go forward. So I had kept the halter and lead rope on her cause she, her side pass cue is not super solid. That was my reasoning at the time, but, um, I do do it at Liberty with the Mustangs and I wish I would have with her as well, but I start them with this like protective contact of the round pen, just in case something were to happen, she could run off into the round pen. She's in a secure place and I'm not in there with her. So, um, that was my goal. But as soon as she takes a step forward, I'm just clicking and treating and then I'm just doing a couple of steps. So this looks very nice. Uh, I like all of this, but yeah, I've taken should take a couple steps. I'm clicking as she's st stepping forward and then I'm feeding her a treat. So that was her first time, like actually taking a few steps besides like one, um, with the sir single on. So it went well, as far as that goes, I wish there was a little bit less tension with me putting it on, but nothing crazy happened. So that's good. <laughs> Want it to be nice and relaxed. 